Did you ever wonder if all the stars were the same? Did you know that some of them pulsate, like Algol the Demon Star? How did it get that name anyway? I'm going to show you how you can learn to see these wondrous objects in space for yourself using our powerful robotic online telescopes, which are situated on mountaintops in Chile and in the Canary Islands off the coast of Morocco, where it is very dark and ideal for astronomy. One of our telescopes is designed just for looking at the sun, which you can see up close and personal every day, weather permitting, of course. You can check that on the satellite view for each observatory. Some of the telescopes are designed for looking at the planets. And some are for looking at objects that are far beyond our own Milky Way. And what's even cooler? You get to control these telescopes yourself, right from your home. And when you schedule a mission, other people can decide to come along. And of course, you can piggyback on their missions as well. Because SLU is a huge global community of people exploring space together. And if you capture something amazing, you'll want to share your pic with everyone and tell them what you see. And then other members can like it and comment on it. And when they do, you'll earn Gravity Points, which is the scoring system of the massive multiplayer game that is powering SLU's group exploration of the universe. But alas, we're getting ahead of ourselves. So let's go back to the start with quests, where you will learn how all of this works. Since space is a pretty big place, we didn't want to send you out there without a map. Quests are like paths through space we have laid out for you, so you don't get lost along the way. They are exploration activities that will challenge you to hunt down phenomena in space, follow in the footsteps of famous discoverers, and build image collections like this poster of the Messier Catalog, which is a wonderful showcase of all the images you will collect. Let's quickly run through a few quests together. Quests offer a step-by-step, -step guided inquiry approach to learning about the cosmos. This is SLU's Lunar Phases quest. Every quest is completed using your observations, images that you have collected using SLU's telescopes. Scheduling a mission to collect images in a quest is easy. Once you have collected your images, selecting them for use in the quest is seamless, and you can choose the image that you want for your poster. Your knowledge and learning will be celebrated when answering the questions that are embedded in the quest, allowing you to progress to the next step. Once you complete the quest, you'll claim your badge, be awarded gravity points for your work, maybe you'll even level up. The poster montage made with your images will be ready for you to download and share with the world. SLU's quests are curriculum oriented and we offer content appropriate for fourth grade through college. The next quest that we will look at is the Life and Death of Stars quest. This one was developed for an advanced high school or college level curriculum. You will be challenged to do research before choosing your images to present in your montage. This will encourage you to engage in higher level thinking as you dig deeper into stars to find the correct types and characteristics to fill in the required image slots. Along the way, you will gain an understanding of stellar life cycles through reading and diagrams as well as increase your observational skills in regards to the celestial objects that you have collected. Your captured images will take on incredible significance as you increase your understanding. You can download your montage at any time, allowing you to check your work and ensure that you are on the right track. Completing this challenging quest will reward you handsomely with hundreds of gravity points and bragging rights when you add this badge to your collection.